Angel the Dance Hall Explorer. Welcome to this week's WBT Empire Dance Hall News. First up in this week's Dance Hall News, Vibes Cartel gets another international mainstream feature, and this time it's on the soundtrack of AMC TV series Preacher. The world boss teamed up with popular Punjabi folk singer Mangi Mahal for his smash hit Bale Shava. The song is now a part of Preacher's soundtrack, which lets Vibes Cartel tap into Preacher's over 3 million viewers per episode. The concept of the track Bale Shava is to fuse the traditional Bangra Dol rhythm, which is from Punjab, India, with contemporary dancehall elements in a dynamic, poetic and energetic song. And for those of you who are wondering what Bale Shava stands for, my Punjabi friend Priya, she explained it to me and she said that Bale is an expression of fun and Shaba is short for Shabas, which is an expression of encouragement and it means something along the lines of you're doing great. Despite being incarcerated since 2011, Vibes Cartel has remained very much relevant in dance hall. The Gaza Nation leader has added significantly to his vast catalogue during his time behind bars and one cannot deny his musical presence overseas. New Vibes Cartel music videos. The world boss has not one, but two hot videos out. The first one is Don't Come Back and it's directed by Damien Gill. It was shot in Kingston and focuses mainly on dancers. In the video, we can see well-known actors like Danny Wu, who looked stunning as usual, and the Supreme Blazers. And surprisingly, there were also Dutch dancers in the video, like Marta van Geel, Joanna Williams, and they're really adding to the diversity of dancers. Now, the video for Mmm by Terminal 4 Media. It's a video that is raw, it's not pretty up nothing, it shows you real life. And in the video, you see all the things that Vibes Cartel mentioned in the song, like the oats, the nuts, the two old woman, even the alien girl that get teleport. Basically, everything how I envisioned it when I first heard the song, that's how the video come out. If you haven't seen them yet, go to Vibes Cartel Vivo channel and check them out. Cardi B gave dancehall artist Vanessa Bling a huge endorsement over the weekend as she continues to celebrate her recent engagement to Migos member Offset. On Sunday, the Bronx rapper showed off her massive 8 carat teardrop shaped ring while listening to Vanessa Bling's 2012 hit single Everything for Holy. Cardi B shared the video with her over 12 million followers on her Instagram story. Everything for Vanessa Bling has since reacted to the endorsement, writing Congrats, hon, you always support my music. You have everything for holding, everything for owning, your good, good way of controlling every night, you know. Cardi B is a big fan of dancehall music and is already planning her wedding to rapper Offset. Just days after getting engaged, sources close to the Bodak Yellow hitmaker say that Cardi is uncertain about a few details on the big day, but one thing is for sure, dancehall music must be played. Sources told the Tropics, we kinda started planning already and she's letting everyone know that a good dancehall disc jockey must be at the reception. Legacy. Last week, someone vandalized Bob Marley's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in America. The star had been pounded on with a sledgehammer or another heavy object like that, and it cost about 3,000 US dollars to repair it. Repairs were paid for by the Hollywood Historic Trust. Spokeswoman for the Walk of Fame, Anna Martinez, tweeted a photo of work being done on the star, and in a recent interview following news of the incident, Martinez revealed that the LAPD, the Los Angeles Police Department, will be carrying out an investigation into the matter with hopes of bringing those guilty of the act to justice. So far, there are no suspects and the reason for the crime also remains unknown. On a brighter note, the late reggae legend Bob Marley is featured on Forbes magazine's list of top earning dead celebrities. After earning 23 million US, the late king of reggae secured the number five spot. That spot was boosted by a sustainably focused House of Marley audio products and the Marley Beverage Company. His son, Rowan Marley, told Forbes magazine, When we decided to start that movement, it was to add relevancy to who we are as a family. We started that to really hone in on our legacy and protect what our father has given us. 
That's all for this week's Dancehall News. Subscribe here if you like Dancehall and we'll be back next week with more. For WBT Empire, I'm Angel, the Dancehall Explorer.